Hello investors, good early morning from Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. This is the Morning Stir Market and Resource Rundown for Thursday, October 18th. Stocks finished positive again on Wednesday for the third consecutive day in a row. The half percentage point gain in the E-mini S&P of seven points was to 1457 and is now 11 points below the September 14th multi-year peak. 1443 support level, which is the halfway break of the October 5th high at 1466 and the 1420 low from last Friday. The blue chips managed to power higher up 43 points with the Dow futures to just below the 13,500 level. IBM was 5% lower to weigh down the index as last week's losses have been erased. The E-mini Nasdaq was uh, a quarter percent higher yesterday, up seven points at 2,772. 2,800 above is the resistance from the October breakdown and 2,700 below is the uh, support from last week's lows. Crude oil finished essentially unchanged at 92.45 with consolidating tight $1.25 range on Wednesday. The 90.27 lows from early in the session on Monday act as the weekly support with the 93.84 September 21st highs as the resistance above to keep an eye on in the crude oil market. The euro currency took out the multi-week highs above the 130.80 level from October 5th yesterday to finish up 80 points at 131.30 as the dollar held on to the 79 level support. December bond futures were down over one and a half full points to 146 and a half after a breakthrough of the 147 and a half halfway point support. Gold was up $4 to $17.50 and silver gained 23 cents to $33.18 for another consecutive three quarters of a point bounce. With a strong three-day market rebound to negate lo last week's losses, where do the markets stand this Thursday morning to start the trading day? Well, things are somewhat quiet here. Right now, the euro currency is steady at 131.16, down 16 points on Thursday morning, as the dollar holds that 79 support. Bonds are seven ticks higher after two big, big down days. Crude oil stuck here at the 92.50 level uh, with only a 40 cent trading range overnight. A larger monthly sideways trading range for the December contract has remained between 88 and 94 dollars for a full month. So right now we've got gold down eight dollars at 1745 with support at Monday's 1730 lows at resistance at the 1760 level. Silver's down 22 cents at 33 dollars even. So as we get started on this Thursday morning, the E-mini S&P is down two points at 14.55. Dow futures are one point higher right now, and Nasdaq futures are five points lower with an hour to go before the stock market open. So to wrap up the current action this Thursday morning, it's somewhat quiet after, two big, after a couple of big days in the marketplace. The euro currency is 16 points lower. Crude is unchanged right now at 92.50 with gold $8 lower. Stock futures are steady to lower with the E-mini S&P at 14.55 down two. The Dow futures here at the CME Group are unchanged right now and just right at the 13,500 level. Please visit our sponsors at MorningMarketStir.com for more information on commodities, futures, and options. I will see you early Friday morning for the Stir in the Markets to set up your trading day. From the CME Group trading floor, it all comes back to commodities.